Hello beautiful people, this is Lenka. Um, today I want to show you my finished, hello kitty, my finished diamond dots painting, white tiger and the two cups. Um, look at this, I even like it more on camera. When I see it on camera it looks even better. So, this painting. It was a very fun one to do. That's really no issue. It's it's always fun to do one with round squares because um round round drills. Um, hi kitty. Because it's easy, or let's say easier, because I know my lines are still not really straight. I I haven't received my tool yet to straighten my lines but it's easier than a square one and what I love about those drills also is um, the white ones are iridescent so I don't know if you can see it if the light catches it mm, do we see it I don't know if I can show you um, because it's it's raining raining outside and when the sun shines you can see all the glitter and all the bling bling you can see it much better but now you cannot see it um, but I can assure you the whites are really gorgeous and at first I thought no nah, it's not gonna work because the other ones are not so sparkly but um, the fact that the whites are, are this sparkly, it gives the picture a, a very other dimension, I think. Oh, I'm, you see, I went over it with a roller and still I'm sometimes losing drills. And I went over it like this with my hands and trying to get every popping drill down. There are not much popping drills, but here and there it's it's um it depends on how you place them if you uh, place them correctly and maybe because i i rolled it up again uh, i should uh, keep my paintings um flat i think maybe that will be better um yeah i lost this one drill i don't know where it goes i cannot see it at first sight but anyway we'll check this later on um so it was a very beautiful one to do. The downside, I think, and maybe that's why I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna try another, um, another one that, that's partial because the background, okay. So the tiger comes out of the background. I can live with that, but there's a foreground also, um, printed on the canvas and it's for me it's a, a bit strange because because of uh, the three-dimensional um, painting that you make the foreground goes in the back and I don't know if I would see it if you see it up close it's weird if you see it from from uh, further away maybe it would be okay but that's the only thing that is going to keep me from doing any more partials, I think. But for the rest, yeah, I adore tigers and I found this a really, really beautiful one to do. And I had no problems with the drills. I had um, every drill I needed because, you know, I said I was a little bit scared of the... But I have got still leftovers and I'm going to keep them like this. Iridescent, iridescent I'm going to keep because... Maybe I can uh, use them to um, do another project, maybe. So I'm very pleased with this one. I probably, probably I'm going to end up give this away because I don't have space to put all my pictures up. So I will need to find someone who's really fond of this picture and fond of um, tigers. But... Um, Diamond Dots, it's really a good company for diamond paintings um, because 
um, the tools they give are very good. Also, the fact that they give the the um, the waxing little little round uh, thingy like that I showed you in my other video. It's like a, a little thing where you put lipstick in or a lip balm, and and that's the way they cover up and the wax and that's very good because the wax when you keep it like that it can it, it, it can trap uh, flint or any dirt and in the in the little bottle it doesn't so that's very good but yeah overall i would give this project uh, five stars maybe not because of the foreground but four stars certainly so this is for my tigers now I'm gonna put this on the side and maybe try to find the missing drill. <laughs> um, I want to show you another one. That's a work in progress. The Ganesha I unboxed before. I'm working on it. <gasps> it's turning out lovely. Can you see it? That's what I did already. And I'm absolutely adoring this picture. The red is so beautiful, um, and for a small one, it's it's thirty by forty. For a small picture, because they always say you have to go big because otherwise you cannot see many details. And but the fact is that the bigger ones are are, are more expensive. So I try to find small ones that are not so expensive, but that give a really good result and this one I think is, is an example of that because uh, I'm, <laughs> I'm catching all the hair um, 30 by 40 but it has 40 colors 40 colors yes correctly 40 colors it's really gorgeous see and that's why when you work with so many colors I believe that's necessary to give the details but I'm gonna be so proud when this is finished because I love it my work in progress yeah I I um, I will put a link down again because the other link I put down I don't think it was the right one but I found the right one it's a uh, in fact it's um, I bought it at Yumi art official uh, no, is it? Yeah, Yumi Art official store. So, and I, I think I will be shopping at that company uh, in the future. So this one I'm working on. Now I want to show you one that I was really waiting for. But when it finally arrived, I was like, oh my God, what did I do? So I was looking for a picture of the disney princess brave you know her i hope this is the one otherwise I'm... yeah it's brave and i thought because i heard yeah you have to go big and i was this was one of the first ones i um ordered and so I ordered a very big one, but now I'm seeing this and I'm, I'm saying to myself, what did I do? Why did I have to buy a big one? It's going to be so much work. Maybe I can do whip and shut. If you would like that, please tell me, but I'm not so very good at it. But I want to try anyway, but this is worth the whip and shut because this is going to take me forever <laughs> but uh, I'm gonna show try to show you how it looks grab my scissors because um so 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 I'm very excited because I love brave oh she's really my favorite character Just look at her. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. 
Now what's gonna be the hardest part? Let me show you. I've got a noodle. And that's, I find it very, very interesting. A very good idea of the people who sent this picture. They send it with, uh, I'm gonna show you. They gave me an extra noodle. So instead of one, I have two. And for a big picture like this, it's really great to have two because I wanna work uh, on this on my desk, but my desk is not big enough to, so I will have to roll one side up as I work. So that's why I'm so happy I've got two noodles. And the plastic. It's strange. It's also uh, divided in two. So you've got two, that's maybe because it's so big. But, but oh, she's gorgeous. Look, 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 look. The only part that I'm gonna resent afterwards. I know, they're sprinkling in the, in the, I hope it's not in the, but I feel it's in the, yeah, it's also in the in the painting, so I will have to sleep on it. I think on under my mattress. I can put this under my mattress. I hope. If not, I can always cut apart <laughs> because this this is gonna take me so much time, and I'm not so fond of um, using a multi placer because multi placers, I've have had the experience that with multi-placers it's very hard to keep your line straight so i'm a fan of the checkboard method yeah i hope i will have the patience to work on this because i'm gonna check there's not much colors there are only so for the hair it will be no all oh, the hair i love here but the colors two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen uh, eighteen twenty one two three four five twenty five colors only and if you see this is a very big one and for my little Ganesha I have got uh what did I say 40 colors and this one is only 25 so yeah it's a big picture maybe I uh, overdid myself a little bit but anyway I will be happy working on this because maybe it will give me um, the experience to work on real big big um, spots with the same color so maybe afterwards i will say i have enough i will never do this again and then i know for the future never to uh have a big piece like this with only 25 colors but she's beautiful oh i love her brave i'm gonna roll this up back up again whoopsie Keep my And I hope I can remove the crinkles. You see there are crinkles in the canvas. I'm not so very sure because I've read somewhere that you can iron it out. But I'm not so fond of ironing because I, I believe it will affect the glue. I don't know. But crinkling. So, oh my god. <laughs> See, that's why I thought, oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be uh, many colors because the package is so big. But it's not because, but I have not very, very, very big amount of the same colors. Yeah, the the, the surface of one color is so big you will have to because the bags are always little small bags but, and I quickly 
I've got an inventory. You know, oops, I ripped it. Oh no. You know how fond I am of doing inventory. See, color A. I've got 29 bags of color A. Um, just checking if the colors are DMC. Col oh, yeah, it's DMC. It's, it says here DMC. C, D, M, C. And they put in two bags like this. So, with the tray and a big amount of wax and a multi placer drill pen. Maybe I will try again. I. I will have to, oh yeah, no. the tweezers. I think these tweezers are very good actually. I don't know. I never tried it to, to do it with tweezers, but this one looks really good too. Yeah, well, maybe I will try it. Because if I want to do this quickly, yeah, it's the process that matters, I know, but you don't want something to take forever, so I will inventory what I'm gonna do off camera. But because afterwards I'm gonna tell you anyway if uh, if there was enough of the colors or not. So then I want to show you two other paintings I received and I got them from Ava in Belgium where uh, they sell diamond dots painting. So I bought two diamond dots paintings because I love the round squares and there was a, a coupon for a sale. So I thought, oh yeah, why not use it for... So I bought one. Do, 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 do. The Llama. I don't know how it's called. Lulu Llama. But it's also a partial, so I think I'm gonna give this to my little girl. Yeah, maybe I should, shouldn't should uh, open the box then. Maybe I will. I will put it back inside. She can open it again. She will be. My little girl, she's six and she started to do one of the uh, diamond painting notebooks that I showed you. In an earlier video so she started to do them that one one of those and she's loving it and she said yeah but I want to do a painting also I don't know if, if this is for her age if it's because it's lots of work many lots of white so maybe I will have to help her but anyway she can try she's six She's really creative and she loves to do creative stuff. So, oh, how is this packed? I don't know. Hmm, weird. Okay, like this. Sorry, I didn't warn you, crinkling. But Diamond Dots, you have to say, loving it because of the extra bags, the little round thingy for the wax one thing to put around your pen and the white drill pen and the yeah that's a great trade it's, it's very a very handy thing with the spout because it's easier to put your diamonds back in the in the bag oh but she's gonna love this this is white and it's not as as shiny as the other ones from my tigers, I must say. It's just white. It's a shame because I was hoping it was the same. Oh, a few special beads. But I'm gonna keep this in the bags and I'm gonna Put it away and I'm gonna give it to my little girl. She's gonna love this. She can work in it forever. <laughs> She's 
on a desk next to my desk and then she starts talking to me all day when she's busy doing something. She's like, Mama, Mama. Yeah, but she's so sweet. And I love working next to her. It's like this mother and daughter thing. It's, it's very cozy. So this is one. And then I've got another one. Diamond.ce. And this one. I'm gonna do myself. And I hope it's uh, it's round squares, I think. I'm gonna check this out. This one is, oh, you know, I love pictures of flowers, but not the regular pictures of flowers. Not like this, I don't know, you know what I mean? Like this cliche things like phases with flowers. No, I love flowers in the wild and in, in real life, but I'm really, really fond of um, dahlias and zinnias. Zinnias, it's a Mexican flower. And this one is a dahlia. It says here, dahlia. Intermediate. Oh, they, what, what do they say? Intermediate. Oh yeah, intermediate. So it's for, not for experts, but for intermediate. I don't know. I never knew that you could be beginner, intermediate, and then expert. Because I think it depends on the painting. Some of them are really easy to do. I love it. Oh, I'm so happy it's not too big. You see? Because with all the reds, oh my god. This is beautiful. It's gonna be beautiful when it's finished. I'm gonna check the... I'm gonna check the crinkling. Be careful. And diamond dots, they always put like these folders inside. And it's very good. So whenever you have questions, maybe I should read them once. I never would read them but i believe it's very helpful for someone who starts doing this so what do we have we have oh with the blue one i wouldn't i would want the pink one also that's the same bags little bags the wax the uh, gray tray and the white pen with uh i don't know how you call this Oh my god. Oh, I love this. Here, the reds, different shades of reds. Red, 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 red. And then, uh, brown, one that's like beige. And then you have yellow. What I like about the yellow is it's, do you see, it's like the, the white ones I told you about with the tiger ear, it's the same with, with yellow ones. The, um, the problem is diamond dots, they have got their own um, number system, I believe. So I think I will have to check it because on the tigers there was no color. No, it's it uh, says D, D. Wait, uh, here you are. D D number. So I believe that's diamond dots number, and it's not D M C. So that's yeah, that's it. Is a shame because I love those those sparkly ones so much, and I wanted to see if it's a, a special. Um, special number of DMC, but apparently it's diamond dots and they've got their own uh, system. I'm gonna try to find it somewhere on the uh, internet. Oh, yeah, I got another bag. A little bit of pinks and black. Yeah, you see, no, it's not really black, it's, it's really dark, dark brown. But anyway, I'm very happy with this one. It's going to be lovely. So... So, 
I've got lots of work to do for next time. Um, maybe I will, one of these days, I will try to do whip and chats. You will have to bear with me because it's it's really new to me. Um, oops, it's always when you take something out of a box, it's it's always beautifully in the box, and then when you try to put it in again, it's like oh no, it doesn't fit anymore. And ah yeah, okay, wait. Think, Lenka, think. So, I will do these paintings. I don't know which one I'm gonna do next. Maybe I'm, after the Ganesha, I will try uh, to do the cats um, from the store Nafra in Belgium I told you about. And um, they sent me a cat. I showed you in the first video, mate, and oh, I really adore the cat. So I will, after my Ganesha, I will try to do the cat first. Because it's always also a small one and I can keep it. It's easier for me to do a smaller one. Because I've got limited space on my desk. And yeah, yeah I, my, my uh, light pad, it's only an A4 size I didn't want to have a bigger one because it would be unnecessary if my my desk is too small but I'm thinking about a place where I can do this one brave I hope I can find somewhere to do this I'm gonna put it back in the bag okay. so if you want to see more or you want to see something else Please contact me or write me in the comments and please subscribe or like, hit the button like if you like this video and I will be back shortly with much more. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Have a great day.